Alright, welcome to day 26. Um, today's goal is to get 60 attacks so I can use dragon weapons, uh, 50 mining, and 50 smithing. I do plan on trying to finish my task uh, with the darts that I have, and I'm pretty sure I won't be able to finish the full task, but at least I'll get it started. Alright, beginning day 26. <laughs> That's cool, dude. Um, so what we're going to try to do is do that, um, task, the blood vines. I forget how many I needed to kill. Oh, hello person. Um, 98. So I'm going to use some more darts. Um, I'm also going to get some, um, food, um, just in case I mess up trying to safe spot them. And then I'm going to try to melee some, or and get some runes and try to use some magic on them. So let's get this day started. Alright, so um, I'm going to show you how to safe spot them when you have the stats. You can see if you're standing here, um, they'll get trapped right here because they're so big um, and they can't reach you. So you can use this as a safe spot. Um, there's also a safe spot over here. If you see that chair, you can stand behind it and range them. But I like this spot better um, because if you can see like he can't get me and then like let's say if he if he's over here I can use this wall again just walk over here and he'll be trapped and I can attack him and it also works if you're on the other side and the blood fell is over on this side it'll get trapped so hopefully that helps you if you have this task and you're like oh man I hate getting hit by them but yeah, so um, I'm not. I don't think I have enough darts to finish this task. Um, so I did buy some uh, mine and fire runes so I can do fire strike. So I did try using magic on them, and it doesn't hit that high. So I'm gonna go ahead and go get 60 attack, and then I'm gonna go for my other two goals of mining and smithing. So um, what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to waste most of the stuff in my inventory um, because I'm going to start training um, mining and smithing and it's going to be in the wild so um, I'm going to use up all my death runes and my earth right now I don't have enough earth runes to use up all the death runes and then when I run out of the earth runes I'm just going to switch to the wind blast and then I'm gonna, um, I might sell these to the store or high them. I'm gonna see what pays more. And I'm probably just gonna die and like leave this, or I don't know yet what I'm gonna do with all this stuff. But yeah, so, um, and it's because the resource area in the wild, if you pay the little person there, it'll note your items. So I was going to make some, ah, uh, please don't attack my, okay, thank you. <laughs> so I was going to make some um, gold bars. And, oh, that reminds me, I have to go get the gloves that I got from the Family Crest um, quest. So I can get extra XP. So that's the second part of my goal today. So hopefully we can do that. And I'm going to try to keep an eye on it and try not to get PK'd, but... Just in case, um, that's why I'm selling all this stuff, just so I'll have the cash, and I'll put it in the Nightmare Zone coffin, and when I'm done I'm getting the levels I want, I'll just buy something else. Alright, so I don't have any more limp roots to use, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and cut down some trees, light them up, and get the ashes when they burn out. And that's just so I can make this um, serums, and the serums gives you about I think the exact same XP as if I was making strength pots. So that's um, 50 XP um, per serum that I make. And then after that, I'm gonna I'm still debating whether to sell all my items, including armor, so I can go to the wild, to the resource area, and start training mining and. Um, smithing there and yeah 
so if I do sell my rune, it, it is going to be like quite a loss because it did cost me 80k for the plate and like 60k for the legs. And I know the store's not going to give me that much. Alright, so I'm over here getting the gloves. Um, let's ask her about something else. Give me my gloves. Come on. There we go. Alright. So I'm going to the shop again to sell my items. Oh my god. Hopefully I I keep hopefully I don't get PK. I'm not even gonna buy a rune pickaxe because if an ultimate dies, you lose everything. Even if you use protect from prayer, protect one item. Like everything. Everything always falls. I think they should have put something else for that. Like, you know, like a little I don't know. But yeah, and I always double check on most of the stuff, like when I come over here, just to make sure that <laughs> I get more than I do than high alking. So it shows um, play body, you'll get 39k. And in this shop, you get 45. Alright, not bad. And 44, so that's, that is higher than the out value. The play cost me, I think it was like 80k. For the plate and the legs cost me 60k. So it's like, what is that? Um, 35k loss on the plate and 60 minus 40. What is that? Well, the, like 15k around there. So the legs isn't that bad. Just the plate. Uh, what else am I gonna sell? Um, I should just go ahead and sell everything. I'll keep the staff because I'm going to need it for some teleports to get everything um, to the right area and stuff. Alright. Bam. Goodbye. Oh, look, it didn't even last long. It just disappeared. Alright, so as you can see, I sold everything I had on me, except the strength Emmy and the uh, Staff of Earth, and the gloves and the frog mask. I have 240k, which I'm going to take out, um, I'm going to try to take out 3.2k to buy the Addy pickaxe, but you can only put money in by 1k amounts and take money out by 1k amount at Nightmare Zone. So um, I don't realize this now but I, I'll figure it out before I start heading over there that I need to bring more cash because it does cost 7.5k to go into the resource area and then it costs 50 gold pieces per item that you want the guy in there to know. So if you're going to do this method, make sure to bring more cash. And it is going to be in a while, so don't bring too much cash because you can you can get PK. Alright, so I buy the pickaxe and then I go fish some food before I head out there because it is in a while. And it's always good to have food. Alright, so let's see if it was worth selling all my shit. <laughs> and getting my fishing and crafting. Uh, <laughs> what fishing and crafting makes no sense. Um, mining and smithing. And alright, let's, let's go inside. There's a white dot up there. That's okay. Oh, open. Yes. Yeah, um. So if you look around, you can see there's like a four um gold um rocks that you can mine. And there's a furnace right there which you can use. So it's a pretty good spot. It's just the only bad thing it's in a while. Alright, so I just got DDoS, I guess, or the server lagged out. Wow, I didn't know that if you get DC'd or if you log out, you appear on the outside and you have to pay to go back inside. But the good thing about that is that if you notice if there's a PKer, they can't log in inside the gate. They have to be outside, so you just keep an eye on at the gate and on your mini map.
Okay, so I keep DCing, and I'm like, well, you know what? Um, let me get some more cash. Also, I did buy a rune pickaxe instead. Since the PKers can't log inside the arena, they have to be outside, so I'll just keep an eye on the gate and on the mini map. Alright, so I'm mining, and this. <laughs> so. <laughs> This high level like tricks me like basically he's like you can see him over here he's 124 and he's like I'm just here to mine um he's like but I got gear too so he's sitting there with a uh, dragon pickaxe mining so I'm like okay that's fine I'm in level 52 so only a 122 or lower can attack me and then I'm like so I'm mining and then I'm about to run up to these rocks and I notice it's going to 53. I'm not sure if it's at 54. If it goes that high. And then he runs up to try to attack me. But I run back down to 52. And then he started, um, how you call it, I'm mining again. So he's sitting there waiting for me to, like, fucking mess up. Like, really, dude. Come on, man. You're 124. You want to kill a level 70? Alright, so my friend told me that um, this is at 53. He must have not known that. But if I step right here, it's level 54, or like one of these two squares, and then he can attack me, and he's 124, and he has a dragon fire shield, so he can use that spec, whip me to death, or DDS me, and um, my defense is only 41, so, you know, I will not stand a chance. So I just have to be careful where I run to, as long as I don't run up here, he, he, he can just sit there and pretend to power mine. Or maybe he is going to mine and then wait for me to mess up or run out and then he's going to break me. <laughs> um, I have 358 um, bars. The reason why my cash is so low now is because I got, I lagged, I guess I'm lagging or something. And they kicked me off and I had to go back in. Then there was a PKer and he was at the door. He was about to jump in and I logged out. <laughs> Also, um, I think I hit the six hour mark or something, even though I've been logging in and out, because out of nowhere I just got logged out, and everything else was like, like I was, I'm watching YouTube and Netflix and all that, everything else was still working. Alright, so I did world hop and then I ran out, because that level 124 was kind of freaking me out, in case you would have brought us pure. Um, I haven't decided how I'm going to train crafting like I don't know what I'm gonna make and what store to sell it to so I'm gonna debate about that before I decided what to do I noticed how late it is so this is gonna be the end of day 26 so let's see um, what we got today all right um, I did um, train attack I got 60 so that went up strength also went up a level and hit points went up a level my mining uh, went up three levels, and my smithing only went up two levels. Also, um, herb lore went up one level because I used up the herbs I had. Um, fishing and cooking also went up one level. And let's see, that. Oh, yeah, I did some wood cutting and fletching for a little bit. So I did get 61 wood cutting. So if I'm able to get a dragon axe, I can use it now. And also, I did get 51 fletching, so I can make the maple um, short bows, which you can do at 50. Um, my slayer didn't go up because I ran out of darts, and I was like, well, let me go, because um, I wanted to do this to get my mining and crafting up. So I was like, well, I'll make them later after I get a whole bunch of gold bars. My total level did go up to 1,148. And with 3.8 mil XP, so that that was a quite bit of levels since yesterday. That would be like, I think that's 15 levels, 15 in total. But yeah, so this is the end of day 26. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like my videos and you want to see more. And I will see y'all next time.